I'm really excited about getting the kitchen bench. I don't know why, I'm not a real cook, but it's kind of a dressy part of the motorhome when everybody has a look at it, it's all very important, you know. In goes here the sink and in goes here the hot plates and all the gear like that. What I'm using is those nice glass top, flip top um, doodang jobs from Dometic. So that when you prop them down, they, they look really good, right? We've laid them on top here, on top of this tape, and then you can text a line around the outside rim there to get the sides. Drop it in another 5mm for your cut so they don't fall through. Hit it with the jigsaw and we'll get it on in pretty soon. Here comes the thing. Now we can have a drink. Got something to do with dishes in there. That's pretty hard work, isn't it? Time for a cold drink. Are you ready to hit the road? Yeah. Go on. Go down and hit it because the motorhome ain't finished yet. On for the road. Talk about shit itself. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That's how we do the washing up. <laughs> now we're cooking. Now I spent about 10 minutes trying to work out these rubbers for the sink and the gas top thing, you know. They come inside the container there with some other bits and pieces and things like that. It's pretty straightforward to fit one of these things like you cut out the hole like we saw. And you've got these little white little thingy rubbers that pull up underneath. You've also got these rubbers which go between your metal surface, your sink and your timber surface there like that. They look like they go one way but they go the other. I'm going to give you a close up look so you can just kind of see what I'm talking about. Here we go. Alright, so here's the rubber here. It's got this little tiny slot in it just in there, right? Little tiny split. So you, you know, naturally it goes over this little sharp edge here. Now you think that this longer flange bit out this side would go outwards onto the bench. But it doesn't. It actually goes the other way. This big part here goes inwards onto the sink. Anyway, when you can't figure these out, have a closer look. Make sure they're in there because it'll stop the vibration and the chitter chatter of the sink and the stove. Who's chatter? Still trying to work out who chatter is. So this is the Dometic three burner gas burner cooktop with a glass lid. We've got the rubber thing on that we we're putting on earlier, and now we're just going to put in the 12 volt. It just hooks up into this little doodang here. And there's a switch in there, so when you've got your gas hooked up, you turn your gas on, flick the switch, some order like that, kaboom, well, hopefully not kaboom, kaheat, sausages, eggs, bacon, pancakes, omelettes. Now I've just hooked up the suburban hot water system for the first time, and I don't know, it's hissing and growling and making funny noises, have a go at this. I don't know if you can hear it, it sounds like the fire breathing dragon, so I've evacuated the vehicle. They hiss, they gurgle. There's a bit of water coming out the side of my utility shower here. Hmm, what a shame, it's not warm, it's cold. Alright, we're getting there though. <laughs> well that was just full of water, the little uh, machiney thing there. <laughs> oh, it's full of what's going on, stuff's leaking and water's everywhere. Alright, what it is, is on these guys here, I just had the taps on and the, you got to make sure the shower's off, that's all. <laughs> Whoops, we just sprung a leak. Oh. Now we've either sprung a leak, or the bus is, you know, urinating. <laughs> so the gas hot water system's gurgling and growling, <laughs> carrying on and the taps spinning and all the rest of it and I smelled some gas in the vehicle so I evacuated the vehicle uh, but it's all good, it's all working out really well yep. now we're doing the big water test now to see how it all goes, we're going to go back the water on now for the first time <laughs> was the uh, mad hysterical laugh necessary? yes it was
pirate chick. The water's going. Yeah, it's coming out the bottom. What? Coming out the bottom. Where's it coming out? Under the bus. Oh. That's... Down here. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. I don't know what that's from. <laughs> so it's all coming together quite nice. We've got this real nice swank bit of marble granite top board here. It's got a nice backsplash thing on it there. And I love these Dometic products they've got with this glass on the top. I like that neat, smooth finish, you know. This is the three burner Dometic gas burner. There's the gas top lid, it pops up like that. Hook it up to the gas, get your certification, hook up your 12 volt like I showed you before. Then you push this little button in here, little sparky, sparky things go on. A little bit of gas, take the sparky off, and there it is. You can do it for the whole lot. Look, I can turn them all on. One, two, three. So there, I've got it all now. You literally cook them with gas. Eggs on that one, sausages on that one, bacon on that one. You can get one of those nice toast cookers. This can all happen here when it's raining outside. You've got to get cooking on the inside. Otherwise, you can go outside and have a barbecue, right? Then you've always got to need your sink. Now, we've tried and tested these products. I'll show you where we are at the moment. We've headed up the north part of Queensland. We've got the sink here hooked up to our water tanks. Now, this is excellent because you need water, always. Water, more, more, more water, wash your discs, all that sort of thing, have a cold drink in the middle of the night. So it's all happening here. It all looks fantastic. These products are great. Turn off the gas and I'll show you where we are. So come along and check this out. I don't know how well you can see how we're going here. We're mobile, on the go. Have a look out the back here. This is a massive big rig. This is the first place that Captain Cook set foot in Queensland. It's called 1770. They named the place after the year that he put his foot down here. It's a gorgeous place. We've got tranquil tropical waters and it's all happening up here in the bus. We're giving it a trial test ride. It's all going well. These products are great and it's all good. Mm -hmm.